Hi everyone, it's nice to see you all here again, royal people. Before we go any further, here is your daily dose of royal news and commentary. Thank you so much for your unwavering love and support, everyone. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for, guys? Press the bell symbol on the day of his wedding, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button now. Although Prince Philip and Queen Elizabeth II promised Prince Edward the title of Duke of Edinburgh, Prince Edward has not yet received it from his brother, King Charles. After having a change of heart, King Charles II is going to bestow the title of Duke of Edinburgh to Prince Edward. This action is said to be an attempt to keep the royal family united and make amends with his younger brother. 94 out of the people who took part in the latest survey approved of the choice. On the day of his marriage to Sophie Rose Jones, Prince Edward was promised the title of Duke of Edinburgh by Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip, however, the Earl Encounters of Wessex have not yet received the desired dupedom since Charles became king. The Queen, the Duke of Edinburgh, and the Prince of Wales have all agreed that Prince Edward should inherit the Duchy of Attenborough in due order, according to a statement released by Buckingham Palace. There were rumours circulating that Prince Charlotte, who is seven years old, was being considered by Charles to become the Duchess of Edinburgh. Edward, who had backed Charles throughout the most recent incident involving Prince Andrew, felt that this was an insult. This was disclosed to the Daily Mail by a person close to Edward. It was a slap in the face, especially considering how helpful Edward has been to Charles regarding Andrew Farago. Edward and Suffy had always thought that their kid would eventually inherit the title as the Queen had promised it to them before she left away. Should Prince Edward be titled Duke of Edinburgh, according to the latest poll? Of the 10,781 participants, 94 said, yes, 6% said, no, and several readers commented with their thoughts on Edward's possible new title. With remarks like, of course he should, and, it's time for Charles to act upon his parents' wishes, several readers expressed support for Edward's appointment as the Duke of Edinburgh, some even went so far as to say that Charles would lose respect and affection if the choice wasn't respected, and that it ought to have been made a long time ago. There were rumours that Charles would reveal the information during his May coronation. Regarding the upholding of the union between England and Scotland, the Edinburgh Jupiter is historically significant. This implies that the title may return to the crown upon Edward's passing and be inherited by his son, the Viscount. 6. Guys, what are your thoughts on this news? Until then, let me know what you think by leaving a comment. I guess all we can do is wait and see if this is a real thing or not. Additionally, you can just subscribe and click the bell symbol to ensure that you never miss another one of my hot royal updates like this one. Many thanks for it.